Caltrans says it's almost done clearing away all the charred debris under the 10 freeway that's been shut down since last weekend's fire and the rain isn't going to delay their work. But the freeway is still expected to be closed three to five weeks because crews need to shore it up and the deck of the road. Uh, Mayor Bass said this morning drivers appeared to be heeding the warning to avoid the area because this morning's commute wasn't as bad as yesterday's, but she still recommends using public transit. Yeah, and the freeway, as you mentioned, remains closed mm -hmm. roughly between Alameda Street and Santa Fe Avenue. The closure affects the connectors to the Golden State 5 freeway, the 101 Hollywood freeway, and the 60 Pomona freeway. Even though city leaders have tried to ease the expected traffic nightmare, it's still not helping a lot of drivers directly affected in the area. Yeah, KCAL's Jasmine Veal is live at 14th and Alameda, where traffic has been a mess really mm -hmm. all day, Jazz. It really has, and the rain is definitely not helping things. I mean, take a look at this traffic here, this traffic jam. It has been nonstop all day here on Alameda. Cars just inching along, and as you said, the mayor has said over and over for drivers to stay on the freeway if they can. So let's take a look at the map. What it is telling me if we wanted to head back to the station there in Studio City. I'm using Google Maps right now, so I entered in the address. And actually, it is saying to take Alameda, this surface street, all the way through downtown, not a freeway as the fastest route. And the drivers I spoke with today say this is what they are finding, these confusing directions on how to get out of this gridlock. Give me one second, I'll get you out. Extra traffic officers Wednesday directed drivers through crowded streets around the 10 freeway in downtown LA. Drivers also tried to follow their own maps. How, what has your map been telling you? I'm trying to get to West Covina. I just got off the freeway right now. It just veered me off right now, so. On to surface streets. Yeah, so I'll see what it's going to have me doing. Manuel Diaz says he's been rerouted several times trying to get to work Wednesday. What have your maps told you on your phone? Uh, maps goes to me all the way to uh, Vernon, come back this way. On surface streets yes, or the freeway? On surface. Back and forth, back and forth, trying to get, get out of here. In circles? Yeah. As I exited the 10 freeway Wednesday morning, Google Maps directed me to turn left on a street that was closed. Turn left, then turn left onto Mateo Street. I was in the helicopter last night during rush hour, and I will tell you, our surface streets look like a parking lot. The office of LA Mayor Karen Bass says the city's information tech agency worked with Waze, Google, and Apple to give the companies the latest emergency information to program into their apps. She says the rain Wednesday will, of course, make traffic worse. My message to Angelinos is number one. Use public transportation. Number two, telecommute. Number three, stay on the freeways, pay attention to your apps, avoid the surface streets because our surface streets cannot accommodate 300,000 riders. So Will Lopez decided to take Metro. Avoid all this mess. So. And, and plus, it, the rain's going to come, so might as well be prepared. But those who did drive seemed to regret doing so. How bad is the traffic? Terrible. <laughs> now, are you eating breakfast in the car? Yes, because I have no time, you know what? what because you I'm stuck here. Yeah, drivers doing whatever they can to just get through this, right? So Apple Maps got back to me, and they say that they regularly update their maps using sources of information, like from the transit agencies, from actual drivers. Google Maps tells me they also use these important sources of information, like the authoritative data that they get from local governments. They do the best they can to keep those maps updated. And as I send it back to you, a live here from downtown, right next to that burned up 10 freeway section, uh, we are in the worst of it. This is definitely the worst pocket and the heaviest traffic right here. Back to you.